If you'd like to support the Boosters Club, you can go to www.boardmanboosters.org. There you can choose if you want to be on the booster level, spirit level, or Spartan level. The Boardman Boosters goal is to continue the support of Boardman and raise the bar for our athletics. The Boardman Schools Fund for Educational Excellence would like to congratulate its teacher grant winners for 2023. Thanks to generous support from the Boardman Community, Boardman Education Association, and the Amy and Lulu Saito Foundation, they've received over $18,000 for classroom projects that go beyond the scope of existing budgets. This is a tradition that began in 2009 and hopes to continue for years to come. To support BSFEE or learn about their annual reverse raffle, please find them on Facebook or visit their website at www.bormanschoolsfund.com. for the last time. Molly DePinto, Sweetheart Section Leader. Leah Pounds, Spartan Silk Section Leader, Head Librarian, Band Historian, Manager. Gianna DeNero, Sweetheart, Band Vocalist. Savannah Watkins, Flute Section Leader, Head Manager, Senior Representative. Angelo Marcella, Guitar, Rhythm Section Leader, Head Manager. Teresa Laverock, Field Conductor, Section Leader, Head Librarian, Head Manager, Secretary. Giovanni Peretti, Bass Drum. Jackson Bogard, trombone section leader. Olivia Shableski, sweetheart, vice president, manager. Mia Gaudio, clarinet section leader. Celesta Richard, percussion, center snare, section leader. Nick Haynes, bass drum. Ivan Lindbergh, bass drum, section leader, manager, senior representative. Landon Stokes, trumpet, section leader. Vinnie Johnstone, trumpet, section leader. Marcus Raybuck, trumpet. Logan Roscoe, band president, section leader, and trumpet player. Emma Moore, alto saxophone. Mary Solis, alto saxophone. Evan Sweeter, alto sax, section leader. Nicholas Rigatilli, alto sax, section leader, treasurer. Alex Cole, alto sax, manager. Vincent Dominic, tenor sax, section leader. Nico Ayres, flute. Boardman Schools would like to thank the Boardman Boosters Club for their hard work and donations to help build Spartan Stadium. If you would like to support the Boosters Club, you can go to www.boardmanboosters.org. 
There you can choose if you want to be on the booster level, spirit level, or spartan level. The Boardman Booster's goal is to continue the support of Boardman and raise the bar for our athletics. The Boardman Schools Fund for Educational Excellence would like to congratulate its teacher grant winners for 2023. Thanks to generous support from the Boardman Community, Boardman Education Association, and the Amy and Lulu Saito Foundation, they've received over $18,000 for classroom projects that go beyond the scope of existing budgets. This is a tradition that began in 2009 and hopes to continue for years to come. To support BSFEE or learn about their annual reverse raffle, please find them on Facebook or visit their website at www.bormanschoolsfund.com. for the last time. Testing, testing, one, two, testing, one, two.
schools would like to thank the Borden Boosters Club for their hard work and donations to help build Spartan Stadium. If you would like to support the Boosters Club, you can go to www.bordenboosters.org. There you can choose if you want to be on the booster level, spirit level, or Spartan level. The Borden Boosters' goal is to continue the support of Borden and raise the bar for our athletics. Stadium. I'm Superintendent Tim Saxton, and tonight you're going to see all kinds of performances, whether it's an athletic performance, an outstanding music performance, our cheerleaders are going to perform, and behind the scenes we have an outstanding tech team that will show live video feed, live replay. But the key to any performance is an outstanding team. I have two team members from Central Office here today. I have our Director of Instruction, Jared Cardillo, and our Coordinator of Student Support, Bart Smith just two members of an outstanding team that leads this district. And surrounded behind me is the newest members of the Spartan team, our newest educators from the class of 2023. So enjoy tonight, and as always, Go Spartans! Hello, my name is John Landers, President of the Borden Board of Education. And with me are fellow board members, Jeff Brown, Vicki Davis, and John Fry. On behalf of the Borden Board of Education and the Borden Local Schools, we welcome everyone to today's contest, and we wish both teams the best of luck. Go Spartans! Good evening. I'm Mark Fitz with the Fire Chief for Board Without Your Fire Department. Hi, Spartan fans. I'm Chief of Police Todd Ward. Hi, I'm Green Kosar, former NFL quarterback and proud 1982 graduate of Borden High School. The following items were not permitted in the stadium. Outside foods, drinks, and umbrellas. Please use a poncho. Also, noisemakers, air horns, cowbells, and special lights. To help with our safety first efforts, reentry is not allowed. Please keep aisles clear and don't stand along railings. Alcohol and smoking of any kind is strictly prohibited on stadium and school grounds. Thank you for your attention and enjoy your night at Spartan Stadium. Good evening and welcome to Borman Spartan Stadium. My name is Marco Marinucci and I'm the athletic director. It is with great pleasure that I welcome you to cheer on our athletes, band members, and VSTN members. We would not be able to operate without the hard work of our athletes, coaches, teachers, administrators, grounds crew, and our supportive families. Please enjoy the evening and go Spartans. Hi, I'm Bruce Black, president of the Borman Booster Club. The Borman Boosters would like to thank our donors and sponsors that help support Borman Athletics and the Spartan Stadium project. On behalf of the Borman Booster Club, we'd like to welcome you to Spartan Stadium. Go Spartans! Welcome everyone to Spartan Stadium. This is Borman High School Principal Mark Zura. I want to personally thank all of you for being here. Please respect the student athletes, respect each other, and most importantly, respect the game. Go Spartans! Good evening and welcome to beautiful Spartan Stadium. My name is Jeff Hamilton and I'm the assistant AD here at Borman High School. In order to make tonight's contest as enjoyable as possible, we ask that you represent your school community in a positive manner. That means follow the rules, show courtesy to fellow fans, officials, coaches, and administrators. As always, respect the game. Go Spartans!
is all about making unforgettable memories underneath the Friday Night Lights. Cheer means to me that it's a way to express myself and connect with others. Hi, my name is Gina Sempera and I'm one of the varsity captains and to me, cheer means family. I've been cheering with these girls for the past four years and I couldn't imagine doing it with anyone else. To me, cheer means teamwork, dedication, and the excitement it brings. To me, cheer means bringing a positive energy to the community and creating a close bond with my team. Cheer to me has been my whole life for 15 years and it always challenges me to be the best version of myself. Hi, I'm Emma Holcomb. Cheerleading means to me, it means to support my team while also being a role model and making lifelong friendships along the way. To me, cheer is a great way to be involved in the school and to show team spirit. To me, cheer is a way to spread your positive energy through the crowd and make relationships with your teammates and your student body. Zinar, number one, athlete. Bill Clark, number two, athlete. Willie Torres, number six, inside linebacker, running back. Bryson Shelton, number 10, D-line. Derek McCullough, 85, tight end, defense end. Brian Conta, number 68, O-line. Mason Pickard, number 65, O-line. Ryan Kelmer, number 13, wide off. Matthew Sims, number 78, O-line, D-line. Austin Coxon, number 80, kicker. Tristan Gilmer, 42, defensive line. Edge is Burko, number 9, ball receiver. Aiden Berg, number 11, wide receiver and DB. Dylan Soto, outside linebacker and wide receiver. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. On behalf of the Board of Education and Administration of Logan High School, we would like to welcome you to Spartan Stadium for tonight's contest, featuring our guests, the Austin Town Pitch Falcons, and the home team, the Borden Spartans. In order to make tonight's contest as enjoyable as possible, please represent your school and community in a positive and respectful manner. That means follow the rules, speak and act responsibly, Show courtesy and respect for your fellow fans, officials, coaches, administrators, authority figures, and of course, your team and the opponents. Let's make tonight's contest great by remembering to respect the game. The officials assigned this contest have been selected according to the procedures adopted by the Ohio High School Athletic Association. The officials are referee Pat Perry, umpire Scott Batson, linesman Terry Swatter, Line Judge Brain Durkin and your back judge Pete Mollica. Emerging leaders, student government, and National Honor Society are collecting money for BHS sophomore Alexander Perry at the homecoming football game. All money collected at the homecoming game will be donated to Alex and his family. We are asking our Spartan community to show Alex that no Spartan fights alone. Two years ago, Alex battled bone cancer, beat the odds, and achieved remission. He returned to school at BHS last year during his freshman year. 
This past August, Alex and his family learned that the cancer returned, and now he is fighting with everything he's got. Alex loves Legos, so look for a Mormon High leader with a Lego Spartan container. Hey Spartans, let's show Alex and the Perry family that no Spartan fights alone! Tom Sinar, number one, athlete. Bill Clark, number two, athlete. Willie Torres, number six, inside linebacker, running back. Bryson Shelton, number 10, D-Lock. Jared McCullough, 85, tight end, D-Lock. Brian Conta, number 68, O-Line. Mason Pickard, number 65, O-Line. Ryan Comer, number 13, wide up. Matthew Timms, number 78, O-Line, D-Lock. Austin Austin, number 80, kicker. Tristan Gilmer, 42, defensive line. Edges Brooke up, number 9, wide receiver. Gibbon Berg, number 11, wide receiver and DB. Dylan Soto, I saw a linebacker and wide receiver. To head on the top. Who do you want to defend? Right here. Boardman won the toss, elected to receive. Gentlemen. Pre-game brought to you by Condado Tacos. Hey Bloods, make sure to stop into Condado Tacos before and after the game. Your starting lineup tonight for the Borden Spartan offense. At left tackle, number 63, Sean O'Mellon. At left guard, number 60, Dominic Gagliano. Your center will be number 68, Ryan Conti. At right guard, number 64, Cam Ganser. Right tackle, number 72, Dom Cordova. Your wide receivers tonight will be number one, Tomas Sandar. Number two, Philip Clark. Number 13, Ryan Calmer. Number 82, Jalen Soto. Number 11, Aiden Bird. And number 19, Mason Narwaki. Your starting running back will be number six, Willie Torres. And your quarterback this evening, number 15, Zach Haas. When the Spartans are on defense, that starting defense will look like this. On the ends, number 16, Ashton Hoover. Number 19, Mason Narwaki. Tackle number 42, Tristan Gilmore. Nose guard number 73, Abdul Abinaj. Your linebackers, number 25, Keith Smith. Number six, Willie Torres. Number five, Victor DiMaggio. Number 24, Vince Atwood. Number 26, Anthony Nespeca. In the defensive backfield, number 11 at corner, Aiden Berg. And number 12, Vincent Butto. Your safeties, number one, Tomas Andar. And number two, Philip Clark.
Test, test.
ladies and gentlemen, for your homecoming pregame enjoyment, we proudly present your very own Bearman Spartan Marching Band. Welcome to the 2023 homecoming game. As a long-standing tradition, homecoming gives the students and alumni an opportunity to honor their team. For this occasion, the senior class selects a queen of the court to preside over the game and dance. At this time, we will present our five lovely candidates. Gianna De Niro. Gianna is the daughter of Tony De Niro and Jennifer De Niro. She's escorted this evening by Nicholas Riccatilli. Peyton Himes. is the daughter of Brian and Rachel Himes. She's escorted by Anthony Price. Mackenzie Kelso. Mackenzie is the daughter of Lisa Houck and Charles Kelso. She is escorted by Jack Neal. Marina Reese. Marina is the daughter of Angie and John Reese. She is escorted by Thomas Andahar. Milana Scrocco. Milana is the daughter of Frank and Amanda Scrocco. She is escorted by Joseph Bellinger.
And now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome 2022 homecoming queen, Maddie Trefecki, and her escort, Tyler Teleski. Tonight, Queen Maddie will crown her successor. Ladies and gentlemen, the homecoming queen for 2023 is Marina Reese. And now please stand and join Queen Marina and her court, the Spartan Marching Band, 8th grade roadies, and band vocalist Gianna De Niro in the playing and singing of the Portman High School alma mater. On behalf of Queen Marina and her course, and all of the Spartan fans, we wish our team good luck tonight in their game against Austin Town Fish.
Martin stands up on your feet. Here come the Spartans! Spartans are led by head coach E.J. Dota. Now entering the stadium, the visiting team from Austin Town, the Fitch Falcons. Fitch enters tonight's game with a record of four and three. They're led by head coach T.J. Parker. And now, ladies and gentlemen, please stand for your hats and join us in the playing and singing of our national anthem. Spartans won the toss tonight. They elected to receive. 
pregame brought to you by Condado Tacos. Hey, buds, make sure to stop into Condado Tacos before and after the game. Kicking off for the Falcons this evening will be number 47, Anthony Ruggles. Back deep for the Spartans, number 11, Aiden Bird, and number one, Tomas Sandar. Turn. He is brought down by a host of Falcons led by Kylan Foster. Andhar returns that kick 26 yards. Sparks will start first and 10. The ball is on their own 27 yard line. Zach Haas pass complete to number two, Philip Clark. He's pushed out of bounds by Damian Pritchard. Gain of four yards, second down and six for the Spartans. Zach Haas pass intended for number six. Willie Torres falls incomplete. On coverage for the Falcons with Alex Hill. That incompletion sets up third down and six. Cross pass intended for number 13, Ryan Shearer falls incomplete. That incompletion sets up fourth down and 10. On the punt for the Spartans, we number 83, Tony Pichero. Back deep for the Falcons, number three, Dan Evans. Pichero's punt travels 38 yards. Ball's fumbled and recovered by Dan Evans. Falcons will take over first and 10. Ball's on their 33 yard line. Williams on the carry. He was tripped up by Andahar. That's a gain of seven yards, second down and three for the Falcons. Sean Vaughn's pass intended for number 16, Dominic Perry, falls incomplete. Out there on coverage for the Spartans was Aiden Berg. That incompletion sets up third down and three. It's third down. the 
first quarter, we have a timeout. Fitch Falcons use their first time out of the half. Thank you to our quarter one sponsor, L. Calvin Jones. L. Calvin Jones, since 1911, committed to helping individuals and business protect what matters most. The one-stop shop for all your insurance and financial service needs. Proud supporter of Boardman Schools. Visit us today at lcalvinjones.com. Yeah, after the timeout, third down and three for the Falcons. Balls on their own four yard line. DJ Williams, the ball carrier. He's pushed out of bounds. Number 22, Ryan Smith was out there. That DJ Williams carry is good for 35 yards and a pitch off in first down. Deshaun Vaughn's pass complete to the great Alex Hill. He was brought down by Vincent Butto. That's a gain of 12 yards and a Falcon first down. Fitch has the ball first and 10. Ball's on the Spartans. 14 yard line. DeAndre Richard on the carry. Victor DiMaggio there for the Spartans. Gain of three yards, second down and seven. Andre Richard in on the carry. Keith Smith was there at the line of scrimmage for the Spartans. No gain on the play. Third down and seven for Fitch. It's third down. Lorenzo takes the pass, he is battled down. Getting credit with that bat down is number 24, Vincent Catboy. That incompletion sets up fourth and six. On to attempt a 27-yard field goal is number 47, Anthony Ruggles. From the hold of Brady Evans, Anthony Ruggles' extra field goal is good. And with 8 minutes and 52 seconds left to go in the first quarter, the new score, Fitch Falcons 3, Burman Spartans 0.
kicking off for the Falcons, number 47, Anthony Ruggles. Back team for the Spartans, number 11, Aiden Berg, and number 23, Marcus Rutledge. Berg on the return. Here's brought down by number 21, Sergio Marinelli. Berg returns that kickoff 27 yards. Sparks will start first and 10. Ball is on their own 29 yard line. Jet sweep. He was brought down by number 10, Juni Higgs. Gain of eight yards, second down and two for Borman. Zach uh, scrambles. Brought down by number 43, Cameron Natale. Gain of a yard, third down and one for Mormon. Willie Torres, the ball carrier. He's brought down by number 33, Dylan Crown. Not before a gain of two yards and a Spartan first down. Spartans have it first and ten. The ball's on their own 41-yard line. Go, boy! Go, boy! Zach Haas again on a quarterback scramble. He's brought down by number 14, Deontay Stallings. Not before gaining nine yards, second down and one for the Spartans. Willie Torres on the run. He's brought to the line of scrimmage for number 12, Keelan Foster. Number four, Donovan Bell Sullivan. No gain on the play. Third and one for Borman. And hard on Jet Sweet. He's been up behind the line of scrimmage by Alex Hill. Loss of three yards, fourth and four for the Spartans. The line of punt for the Spartans, number 83, Tony Pichero. Back deep for the Falcons, number 10, Juni Higgs. Also back to number three, Dan Evans. Dan Evans on the punt return, touchdown Falcons.
Out of the hole to Brady Evans, Anthony Ruggles, extra point is good. Your new score, Fish Falcons 10, Borden Spark 0. to our quarter one sponsor, L. Calvin Jones. L. Calvin Jones, since 1911, committed to helping individuals and business protect what matters most. Your one-stop shop for all your insurance and financial service needs. Proud supporter of Boardman Schools. Visit us today at lcalvinjones.com. Kicking off for the Falcons, number 47, Anthony Ruggles. Back deep for the Spartans, Marcus Rutledge and Aiden Berg. Side kick was recovered by the Spartans. Getting credit with that recovery was number nine, Andrew Saverko. Spartans will have the ball first and ten. Ball is on their own, 46 yard line. Zach Haas pass complete to number 11, Aiden Berg. So pick it up a five yards, second down and five for the Spartans. <laughs> Willie Torres, the ball carrier. He's brought down by number 12, Kylan Foster. Gain of a yard, third down and four for the Spartans. Zach Haas pass complete to number six, Willie Torres. Rocco DeFlorio there for the Falcons. Other me is fast. Get back. Game of yard on the play. Fourth down and three for Borman. Zach Haas pass complete to number one, Tomas Andahar. He's brought down right at the chains by number three, Dan Evans. He's marked just a little short. Turnover on downs, Fitz Falcon football.
the Sean Boss Pass is intercepted. Bring down that interception is number one, Tomas Andahar. And Har returns that interception, 17 yards. He'll set the Spartans up first in 10. The ball is at the Falcons, 37 yard line. Zach Hawes pass intended for number 13, Ryan Calmer, is incomplete. Out there on coverage for the Falcons was number three, Dan Evans. Second down and 10 for Borman. Zach Hoss on a quarterback keeper. He's been up behind the line of scrimmage by number six, Devin Phillips. A loss of three yards, third down and 13. Zach Hoss on the quarterback draw. Xavier again there for the Falcons. That's a big up of six yards, fourth down and seven for the Spartans. Zach Haas is sacked on the play. Getting credit with that sack is number 44, Rocco DeFlorio. There is a penalty flag on the play. Holding, offense, number 59. Penalty is declined. First town, Austin town. Deshaun Vaughn's pass complete to number 11, Brady Evans. Love Vaughn, Evans completion is good for 13 yards and a Falcon first down. Deshaun Vaughn's pass complete to number 3, Dan Evans. And out there for the Spartans, number 25, Keith Smith. A loss of two yards on the play, second down and 12 for the Falcons.
DeAndre Richard, the ball carrier. Richard picks up 13 yards for Fish Falcon, first down. For the Spartans, Willie Torres was there bringing him down. First and 10 pitch, the ball is on the Spartans, 36 yard line. The Sean Vaughn's pass, intended for number 16, Dominic Perry falls incomplete. Out there on coverage for the Spartans, number 11, Aiden Bird, second down and 10, Falcons. Sean Bonds pass complete. Complete to number eight, Allen Hill. Out there for the Spartans, number 12, Vincent Butto. Limits that game to two yards. Second, third down, and eight for the Falcons. It's third down. And with that play, from around the area. Late in the first quarter, Cardinal Mooney 7, E6. First quarter, Maslin 7, Warren Harding 0. Second quarter, McDonald 7, Springfield 7. First quarter, South Lane 7, Louisville 0. To start the second quarter, the Falcons will have a third and eight. It's third down. Deshaun Vaughn's pass completes to number eight, Allen Hill. On the tackle for the Sparks was number 12, Vincent Butto. That completion's good for 15 yards and a pitch falcon in the first down. <laughs> DeAndre Richard on the carry. Willie Torres there for the Spartans. Gain of six yards, second down, and four for the Falcons. Richard again on the carry. For the Sparks, number one, Andahar, and number six, Torres. That run will set up first and goal for the Falcons. Ball is inside Sparks' two yard line.
the Andre Richard, the ball throw, touchdown, Austin Town pitch. Anthony Ruggles, the extra point is good. Thank you to our second quarter sponsor. The second quarter is brought to you by the CTW Development Corps, Kensington Golf Club and Grill. Kensington Golf Club and Grill is open to the public and offers 18 holes of championship golf and a full menu bar and grill. Located next to the Courtyard Marriott and Waypoint 4180 in Canfield, Kensington Grill is open year-round, serving as the perfect game day spot or place to take your family for a delicious meal. To all new Marriott Spring Hill and Town Place extended stay streets, opening soon in the Westford lifestyle community. Kicking off for the Falcons, number 47, Anthony Ruggles. Back team for the Spartans, number 11, Aiden Bird. And number 23, Marcus Rutledge. Marcus Rutledge on the return. For the Falcons, Sergio Marinelli brings him down. Rutledge returns to that kick 26 yards. Sparks will have it first and 10. Balls on their own, 28 yard line. Zach Haas pass intended for number 82, Jalen Soto falls incomplete. Davion Pritchard was on coverage for the Falcons, second down and 10. Ryan Smith, the ball carrier. He was met by a host of Falcons, led by number 13, Marky Fitzgerald. Gain of two yards, third down and eight for Borman. Zach Haas pass intended for number 82, Jalen Soto, is incomplete. There is a penalty flag on the play. Holding, defense, number three, 10-yard penalty, first down. After the 10 yard penalty, Sparks will have it first and 10. Ball is on their own, 41 yard line. Oh 
to pass the ice past the breed, to Tomas and the Harv, to Lanzo Tate there for the Falcons. Not before a gain of 12 yards and a Spartan first down. Ryan Smith, the ball carrier. He's been in the hole by number four, Donovan Bell Sullivan. Gain of a yard, second down and nine. Zach Oz pass complete to number one, Tomas Sandahar. Getting credit with the tackles, number seven, JJ Grise. Spartan completion was good for two yards. It'll set up third down and seven for Borman. Zach Haas pass complete to number 22, Ryan Smith. JJ Grise there again for the Falcons. It's a gain of five yards, it'll set up fourth down in a long two. Zach Haas pass intended for number one, Tomas Andahar falls incomplete. Out there on coverage for the Falcons was number 14, Deontay Stallings. That incompletion sets up a turnover on downs. Fitch Falcons will take over first and 10. Falls on their own 40 yard line. Brady Evans on the jet sweep. His brought down to number 42, Tristan Gilmer. Brady Evans carries good for four yards, second down and six for the Falcons. Deshaun Vaughn's pass and tender for number two, Davion Pritchard is incomplete. Out there on coverage for the Spartans is number 24, Vince Atwood. That incompletion sets up third down and six. It's third down. Sean Barnes pass and ten for number three. Dan Evans falls incomplete. Out there on coverage for the Sparks is number two, Philip Clark. 
And incompletion sets up fourth down and six. On the punt for the Falcons, number 47, Anthony Ruggles. Back team for the Spartans, number one, Tomas Sandar. Turn is brought down by number 33, Dylan Crone. Ruggles punch travels 36 yards. Nothing on the return. Sparks will start first and 10. Ball is on their own 20 yard line. Zach Haas pass complete to number one, Tomas Andahar. That completion is good for six yards, second down, and four for the Spartans. Ryan Smith, the ball carrier. First guy there for the Falcons was Kylan Foster. No gain on the play. Third down and four for Boardman. Zach Haas pass intended for number 82, Jalen Soto is ruled incomplete. Fourth down and four for the Spartans. On the punt for Boardman, number 83, Tony Pichero. Back team for the Falcons, number 10, Junie Higgs. And number three, Dan Evans. Before the snap, we have a penalty. False start, offense, number nine. Five yard penalty, fourth down. Tony Pinchero's punt travels 41 yards before being down. Fitz Falcons will take over. First and 10. Balls on their own, 38 yard line. Deshaun Vaughn's pass complete to Allen Hill. He's ran out of bounds by number 12, Vincent Butto. Gain of two yards, second down and eight for pitch.
DeAndre Richard, the ball carrier. Tristan Gilmer with the tackle for the Spartans. It's a gain of six yards. It'll set up third down and two for the Falcons. It's third down. Sean Vaughn's pass complete to number four, Donovan Bell Sullivan. Out there are coverage for the Spartans, number two, Philip Clark. Has a gain of seven yards and a pitch pocket in the first down. Judy Higgs, the ball carrier. He was tripped up by number one, Tomas Andahar. That's getting a four yard second down and six. DeAndre Richard, the ball carrier. He was met behind the line of scrimmage by number 24, Vince Atwood. A loss of two yards, third down and six for the Falcons. Deshaun Vaughn's pass is intercepted. Getting credit with that interception is number 11, Aiden Berg. Spartans will have it first and 10. Balls on their own five yard line. That instant replay was brought to you by Raising Canes. They are a proud sponsor of instant replay for Bourbon Spartans football this season. Raising Canes is your post-game celebration headquarters. Torres on the carry. Marky Fitzgerald there for the Falcons. It's a gain of four yards, second down, and six for Borman. Thank you to our second quarter sponsor. The second quarter is brought to you by the CTW Development Corps, Kensington Golf Club and Grill. Kensington Golf Club and Grill is open to the public and offers 18 holes of championship golf and a full menu bar and grill. 
located next to the Courtyard Marriott and Waypoint 4180 in Canfield. Kensington Grill is open year-round, serving as the perfect game day spot or place to take your family for a delicious meal. The all-new Marriott Spring Hill and Town Place Extended Stay Suites, opening soon in the Westford lifestyle community. Before the snap, we have a penalty. False start, offense number 63. Half the distance to the goal, second down. Zakas pass complete to Tomas Sandar. Here's my time at number one, Alex Hill. Not before a gain of 13 yards and a Spartan first down. Willie Torres on the carry for the Falcons, number 13, Marky Fitzgerald. Gain of two yards, second down and eight for the Spartans. Zach Haas pass complete to number one, Tomas in our Here's back down by number 14, Deontay Stallings. Timeout, Austin Town, their second. Updated scores from around the area. Second quarter, Cardinal Mooney 14, East 12. Second quarter, Brookfield 28, Newton Falls 6. Second quarter, LeBray 16, Camel 0. Second quarter, Springfield 14, McDonald 7. Second quarter, South Range 10, Louisville 8. Second quarter, Struthers 7, Nile 0. Second quarter, West Branch 28, Carrollton 7. After the timeout, Sparks will have it. Third down, seven yards to go. Zach Haas pass, intended for number 19, Mason Milwaukee Falls, incomplete. Out there on coverage for the Falcons was number 14, Deontay Stallings. That completion sets up fourth down and seven. On his part, plan for the Spartans, number 83, Tony Pichero. Back deep for the Falcons, number three, Dan Evans. Timeout, Boardman. They're first.
Mormon Youth Wrestling is having sign-ups right now. It's behind the home bleachers. Registration and sign-ups take place all the way now, and then on Monday, October 23rd, 6.30 to 8, at the Mormon Wrestling Facility. Cost is $75 per wrestler. Each additional sibling is $25. Grades third through six is who this is targeted for. Pichero's punt is blocked. Fitz Falcons recover that block punt. They will take over first and ten. The ball is on the Spartans' 14-yard line. Timeout, Boardman, their second. Under attempting 31 yard field goal is number 47, Anthony Ruggles. And out of the hole to Brady Evans, Anthony Ruggles' field goal is good. And that play will take us to halftime. The new score the Fitz Falcons 20, the Burma Spartans 0. Emerging leaders, student government, and National Honor Society are collecting money for BHS sophomore Alexander Perry at the homecoming football game. All money collected at the homecoming game will be donated to Alex and his family. We are asking our Spartan community to show Alex that no Spartan fights alone. Two years ago, Alex battled bone cancer, beat the odds, and achieved remission. He returned to school at BHS last year during his freshman year. This past August, Alex and his family learned that the cancer returned, and now he is fighting with everything he's got. Alex loves Legos, so look for a Borman High leader with a Lego Spartan container. Hey Spartans, let's show Alex and the great family that no Spartan fights alone! Welcome to the Halftime Show. We proudly present the 2023-2024 Fitch Marching Band under the direction of Mr. Jeremy McLean, Assistant Director Mr. Caleb Baldwin, Drumline Instructor Mr. Bill Gonda, and Auxiliary Line Instructor Mrs. Jen Cooley. Band led onto the field by drumline captain Ariana Bortness and Matthew Smith, flag line captain Audrey Park, rifle line co captains Elizabeth Spalding and Megan Battis, color guard captain Anastasia Walker, senior drum major Jared Givanone, and junior drum major Mitchell Roach. This evening's halftime performance will showcase music selected by the class of 2024 and marching maneuvers written by our senior drum major Jared Givanone. The band steps off with the official march of the Marine Corps, Semper Fidelis.
This next piece was selected by our senior band members. It's an exhilarating medley of music from the opera Carmen. And now, the Austin Town tradition continues with the Color Guard presentation of the American flag as the band concludes with our national march, the Stars and Stripes Forever.
We ask the town of Hitchpan would like to thank everyone for their continued support, and we wish the best of luck to Coach Parker and our Fitch Falcon football team in the second half. Go Falcons, march on. Ladies and gentlemen, for your homecoming halftime enjoyment, we proudly present your very own Norman Spartan Marching Band. As Halloween decorations start appearing, this song makes a yearly resurgence. Featuring the Spartan Silks and Sweethearts, here is Michael Jackson's Thriller.
now, ladies and gentlemen, a bourbon homecoming tradition for over 40 years. Go line to go line, playing in marching Spartans, your bourbon band and the exciting Can Can. Spartan Marching Band. and an orchestra parents and Diana Sadzinski for tonight's refreshments. We'd also like to thank the generous residents of Boardman that helped us exceed our goal at our annual Tag Day fundraiser a few weeks ago. Your donations enable the Boardman Band and orchestra parents to serve our students in so many ways. And finally, ladies and gentlemen, the Spartan Marching Band will be in concert on Saturday, October 28th at 7 p.m. in the PHS Gymnasium. Please join us for this retrospective of the entire 2023 marching band season and some special treats. I'd like to thank our halftime sponsor. That halftime show was brought to you by Buffalo Wild Wings. We know halftime's almost over, but after the game, check out B Dubs. Ladies and gentlemen, get out your 50-50 tickets. Tonight's winner will take home over $300. Winning 50-50 ticket. It's a yellow ticket. 335-420. Again, that winning ticket, yellow ticket, 335-420. Come up to the press box to claim your prize. Bring your ticket. We will not take your word for it.
Corbin Spurs will kick off to start the second half. Handing those duties is number 30, Costa Severco. Back deep for the Falcons, number two, Davion Pritchard, and number three, Dan Evans. Borman Spartans with the onside kick. Roman Spurs execute the onside kick to perfection. Recovering that kick was number six, Willie Torres. Roman Spurs will have the ball to start the second half. They'll have the first and ten. Ball is on the Fitz Falcon 49 yard line. Zach's pass complete to number 82, Jalen Soto. Davion Pritchard there for the Falcons. Gain of two yards, second down, and eight for the Spartans. Zach Haas on a quarterback scramble. Rocco DeFlorio out there for the Falcons. Pick up of two yards. Third down and six for the Spartans. Zach Claus pass, intended for number one, Tomas, and our falls incomplete. On coverage for the Falcons, number zero, Clemenzo Tate, and number 14, Deontay Stallings. Incompletion sets up fourth down and six. Zach Hall's pass and Jennifer Andrehar falls incomplete. Deontay Stallings there for the Falcons. That incompletion is a turnover on downs. Fitz Falcons will take over. First and 10, balls on their own, 46 yard line. DeAndre Richard on the carry. First guy there for the Spartans was Willie Torres. Gain of five yards, second down, and five for Fitch. Richard again on the carry. He's met in the line of scrimmage by number one, Tomah Sandahar. Sandahar. 
No gain on the play. Third down and five for the Falcons. It's third down. Deshaun Vaughn's pass complete to number 11, Brady Evans. On coverage for the Spurs, number 11, Aiden Bird. It's a gain of six yards and a pitch Falcon first down. Deshaun Vaughn's pass and turn for number three, Dan Evans is incomplete. On coverage for the Sparks is number one, Tomah Sandor. Second down and 10, Fitch. Ball is on the Spartans' 43 yard line. DeAndre Richard on the carry. He was tripped up by number 24, Vince Atwood. Also there, number 16, Ashton Hoover. As he gained up 10 yards for the Pitch Falcon, first down. Andre Richard on the carry. He was hit by number five, Victor DiMaggio, who caused the fumble. It was recovered by number six, Willie Torres. There is a penalty flag after the play. The fumble was recovered by Boardman. After the play, unsportsmanlike conduct, Boardman, number six, 15-yard penalty. That is the first unsportsmanlike for number six. After the 15-yard markoff, Spartans will have it first and 10. Balls on their own 30-yard line. Zachos pass complete to number nine, Andrew Severco. He was dropped by number six, Devin Phillips. Gain of eight yards, second down and two for Borgman. Zach Haas pass, and tenor for number one, Tomas Sandahar falls incomplete. Marty Fitzgerald on coverage for the Falcons. Third down and two for Borgman.
Zagos has complete to number nine, Andrew Saberko. Alex Hill there for the Falcons. Gain of a yard, fourth down and one for the Spartans. Willie Torres on the carry. Dylan Crone was the first guy there for the Falcons. He was met behind the line of scrimmage. Turnover on downs. Falcons take over, first and 10. Balls on the Spartans, 38 yard line. Judy Higgs, the ball carrier. For the Spartans, number 25, Keith Smith. Also in there was number 50, Darion McCullough. Came to five yards, second down and five for Fitch. Ball's on the Spartans, 34 yard line. Deshaun Vaughn's pass intended for number three, Dan Evans is incomplete. Out there on coverage for the Spurs is number five, Victor DiMaggio. That incompletion sets up third down. It's third and six. Sean Vaughn is sacked on the play. Getting credit with that sack is number 42, Tristan Gilmer, and number 24, Vince Atwood. A loss of seven yards on the play. That'll set up fourth down and 13. On the punt for the Falcons, number 47, Anthony Ruggles. Back deep for the Spartans, Tomas Sandoff. Ruggles punt travels 34 yards. Fair catch by Andahar. Spartans will take over first to 10. Balls on the seven yard line. Zach Haas pass complete to Andahar. Alex Hill with the tackle for the Falcons. Gain of five yards. Second down and five for the Spartans. Woody Torres on the carry. Keelan Foster there for the Falcons. 
Gain of four yards, third down and one for the Spartans. Let's be this height. Missile. Timeout, Boardman. Their first. And after every home game, bring in your ticket and save 50% off for purchase between 9 and 11 p.m. Thank you to our third quarter sponsor, the Hot Dog Shop. The Boardman Hot Dog Shop is open late for Spartan fans after every home game. Bring in your ticket and save 50% off for purchase between 9 and 11 p.m. After the timeout, Sparks had a third down, one yard to go. Zrakha's pass is incomplete. There is a penalty flag on the play. Intentional grounding, offense number 15. The player was out of the tackle box, but the ball did not make the line of scrimmage. Safety. Kicking the free kick for the Spartans. Number 30, Costa Saberco. Batting for the Falcons, number three, Dan Evans. And number two, Dillion Pritchard. Davion Pritchard returns that kick to the Spartans' 27 yard line. Falcons will take over first and 10.
Deshaun Barnes pass, and turnover number eight, Allen Hill, is broken up by Vincent Butto. Playing completion sets up second down and 10. DeAndre Richard, the ball carrier, is by down by number two, Philip Clark, and number 24, Vince Atwood. It's a game of five yards. Third down and five for the Falcons. It's third down. Richard again on the carry. He's met in the hole by number 42, Tristan Gilmer. Lots of the yard on the play. Fourth down and six for the Falcons. Falcons break the huddle going for it on fourth and six. Deshaun Vaughn's pass, complete to number 10, Juni Higgs. Vaughn to Higgs, completion's good for seven yards, and a pitch falcon, first down. Deshaun Vaughn on a quarterback keeper. He's chased out of bounds by number 32, Anthony Despecca. Hey, where are we going? Oh, you want, I don't know what they're talking about. Hey, Tina, where are you taking us? Ah. Y'all go, can we go up here? Where are we going? I'm not sitting with them. Who? I, I know, I just said, can we go up here? Can we go to the play? Second down and nine for the Falcons. Guys, come to the students section. We have some high school friends there. They're cool. I'm not just talking. Can we all go in the press box, Danny? No. <laughs> Judy Higgs on the game. He's brought down by number 12, Vincent Butto. That's a game of 11 yards. Sets the Falcons up first in goal. The ball is on the Spartans' five yard line. Higgs again on the carry. He's met behind the line of scrimmage by number 24, Vince Atwood. Loss of the yard on the play. Second down and goal from the six yard line. Andre Richard, the ball carrier, touchdown Falcons.
He had in the hole to Pete Evans. Anthony Ruggles, that's the point, is good. One of the third quarter sponsor, the hot dog. Shop. The Border Hot Dog Shop is open late for Spartan fans after every home game. Bring in your ticket and save 50% off for purchase between 9 and 11 p.m. Kicking off for the Fish Falcons, number 47, Anthony Ruggles. Batting for the Spartans, number 23, Marcus Rutledge. And number 12, Vincent Beto. Ruggles' kick goes into the end zone. Touchback. Spartans will take over first and ten. Ball's on the road, 20 yard line. Zach Haas pass complete to number nine, Andrew Saberko. Marky Fitzgerald there for the Falcons. Gain of seven yards, second down and three for Borman. Zach Oz pass, complete to number two, Philip Clark. Deontay Stallings there for the Falcons. No gain on the play, third down and three for the Sparks. Zach Haas pass intended for number one, Tomas Andahar, incomplete. On coverage for the Falcons, number one, Alex Hill. That'll set up fourth down and three. On the punt for the Spartans, number 83, Tony Pichero. Back deep for Fitch, number 10, Junie Hicks. Pichero's punch travels 24 yards before being down by the Spartans. Austin Fitch will take over first and 10. Balls on their own 48 yard line.
Deshaun Vaughn's pass complete to number 16, Dominic Perry. Is brought down by number 11, Aiden Bird. There is a penalty flag on the play. Ineligible receiver downfield on the offense, number 52. Five yard penalty, first down. He runs for the rooster down the carry. He's knocked out of bounds by number two, Philip Clark. And with that rooster carry, third quarter comes to an end. Your score ahead in the fourth quarter. Fish Park is 29, Bourbon Park zero. Thank you to our fourth course sponsor, Roger Grill and Tavern. Roger Tavern is your Spartans Victory Party headquarters. We have an amazing selection of food, drinks, and fun. Stop in after the game. Start the fourth quarter. Fitch will have it first and ten. Balls on the Spartans' 37 yard line. Judy Hicks, the ball carrier for the Falcons. Here's my time at number 16, Ashton Hoover. Gain of four yards, second down, and six for the Falcons. <laughs> Deshaun Vaughn's pass completes to number 16, John Perry. He's knocked out of bounds by number one, Tomas Sandahar. That's a gain of 26 yards and set the Falcons up first in goal. The ball was on the Spartans' seven yard line. Judy Hicks, the ball carrier. He was brought down by number five, Victor DiMaggio. It's 
It's a gain of five yards, second down and goal. The ball is on the Spartans' two yard line. Here's again on the carry. He's met by a host of Spartans led by number 16, Ashton Hoover. No gain on the play. Third and goal from the Spartans' two yard line. Sean Barnes pass, 10 for Gain and Evans, there is the penalty flag on the play. Ineligible man downfield on the offense, number 43. He was covered up and went downfield. After the five-yard mark off against the Falcons, it'll be third and goal from the seven-yard line. Fitch, their first. Thank you to our fourth course sponsor, Roger Grill and Tavern. Roger Tavern is your Spartans Victory Party headquarters. We have an amazing selection of food, drinks, and fun. Stop in after the game. Updated scores from around the area. Cardinal Mooney, 35, East 18. Liberty, 49, Champion, 0. Gerard, 14, Hubbard, 7. Maslin 42, Warren Hardy 7. Springfield 21, McDonald 7. Poland 21, Lakeview 0. Marlington 27, Salem 7. South Range 31, Louisville 8. Sean Barnes pass, complete to number eight, Allen Hill, touchdown Falcons. Out of the road of Brady Evans, Jackson Faulkner's extra point is good.
Kicking off for the Falcons, number 81, Jackson Faulkner. That team for the Sparks, number 11, Aiden Berg. And number 23, Marcus Rutledge. Marcus Rutledge on the return. Keelan Foster with the tackle. After the Rutledge returns, Sparks will have it first and 10. Balls on their own 25 yard line. Stackhouse pass and turn for number one, Tomas Andahar falls incomplete. Second down in 10 for the Spartans. Zach Haas pass and turn for number one, Andahar falls incomplete. Alex Hill on coverage for the Falcons. Third down and 10, Borden. Zaghaz pass and turn for number one, Andahar. Broken up by number three, Dan Evans. Fourth down and 10 for the Spartans. for the Spartans, number 83, Terry Pichero. Back team for the Falcons, Dan Evans. <laughs> Evans on the return. Victor DiMaggio there for the Spartans. There is the penalty flag on the play. After the mark off on the penalty, Fitch will have it first and 10. Ball is on the road, 42 yard line. Junior is the ball carrier. He is tripped up by number one, Tomas Andahar. Gain of 13 yards. And a fish falcon first down. Brady Evans going to jet sweep. He's knocked out of bounds by number five, Victor DiMaggio.
No gain on the play, second down and 10 for the Falcons. Dwayne's Tate on the carry. He picks up nine yards. Getting credit with that tackle is number six, Willie Torres. Third down and one for the Falcons. He was brought down by number 45, James Mitchell. It's a game of six yards and a pocket in the first down. Routine on the carry. He was brought down by number 28, Ryan Shearer. Gain of eight yards, second down and two. on the carry, there is a penalty flag on the play. Holding, offense, number 71, 10-yard penalty, first down. Davis on the carry. He's hit by number five, Victor Lamoggio. Loss of seven on the play. Delay of game, offense, five yard penalty, third down. Rotates pass complete to number 28, George Hannes. 
Number 25, Keith Smith. And with that, the game is my final.